All right, we're looking at question three. Wants to draw eight isomers that have a formula of C5H11Br. All right, I'm gonna try to keep this simple at first, and we're gonna try to do this where there's five carbons in a row, hopefully all single bonds. All right, and I'll just put the bromine on the end. All right, that means I have those two hydrogens, those two hydrogens, those two hydrogens, those two hydrogens, and this one has three. That would be 11 hydrogens. All right, so I don't have any single, I don't have any double bonds or anything. This is just going to be uh, carbons and hydrogens and bromines kind of behaving like normal. All right, I want to come up with a name of that. I'm just going to call that one bromo pentane. All right, now I believe I get another of these pentanes by putting the bromine there. And then one more, we'll put the bromine in the middle. Now, any other location, just a duplicate, because if I put it at that location, it'd just be two bromo, and if I did it there, it'd be back to one. So these are the only, this is the three ways I could make five carbons in a row and put a single pentane on there. All right, so the rest must involve changing how the backbone goes together. So I'm gonna try that with four carbons and I'll put the fifth off that second location. That gives me a different carbon backbone. All right, so I can put a bromine on that end. Now if I put it there, that's still the bromine off that end. I just changed where one location is. So I'm going to put a bromine on the second one of this. And third would be different. And off the end would be yet a different one. Okay, this one would be one bromo, two methyl. Butane. This would be 2 bromo, 2 methyl, butane. Have to start numbering backwards now, so that's 2 bromo, 3 methyl, and this would be 1 bromo, 3 methyl butane. And our final one must be three in a row with the extra carbons on the middle. Yep, and that would be it because I'm just going to put a bromine there. It wouldn't matter any of those three locations, three other carbons, it'd give the same thing. So I have one bromo, two, two, dimethyl, propane. And there is all eight structures and names. Um, theoretically, I should go back and add a bunch of hydrogens on here or do the condensed structures. Didn't very good, do a very good job of leaving myself self room for doing that. So I'm just going to put little dashes there to represent where the hydrogens are. I think if I were redoing this page, might save myself some time and do these all as nice little skeletals.